What is going on guys? Welcome back to another video. Today we have some gameplay with this man right here. New player Jonathan Joseph guys. 88 speed, 88 acceleration, 83 agility, 86 jumping, 90 player rate, 88 man, 87 zone, 86 press. He also has 90 awareness. He is a new veteran player. Let's check out the abilities he can get. The first law he can get Homer, Endor Baller, Outmatch, Second Win, Short Route KO, and Tip Drill. And the second one he can get Deep Route KO, Chalk Out, Acrobat, Medium Route, Clutch, Bench Press, One Step Back Head, Homer, Endor Baller, Short Route KO, Tip Drill, Outmatch, and Second Win. I'm gonna be using him with One Step Ahead, guys. This um, video is going to be a little bit different. I'm going to do a voiceover in all the, the clips that he is going to play in. If you like the video, guys, if you find it informative, please leave a like, guys. Subscribe, comment, leave all that good stuff down below. But until then, guys, I will see you next time. Ciao. Jonathan Joseph, guys. What a cornerback. What a, what a cornerback. I'm not even going to lie. I feel this is a top five corner. He played amazing for me, guys. He literally was running routes sometimes for the receivers. He was feeling super fast, even though he's 88 speed. He was feeling very, very fast. He was. He actually felt like he actually knew what was going on, you know, when, he, when I think about his 18, that the cornerbacks reacted to two routes at the same time. This guy actually did that twice for me, guys. He is really, really solid. He is a run... 180k I think and if you compare that to the other top five cornerbacks since Ward, Byron Jones, Asante Samuel and uh, other players they're all over 300k guys this guy is below 200k if I had to choose one cornerback out of all the previously mentioned I will easily take Jonathan Joseph for the simple fact that he is very very affordable and he's a top five corner he can do everything the other guys can do. He can play man, he can play zone, and he's fast enough. Before him, I was using Gilmore, the 88, I think is, and it's a big improvement over Gilmore, guys. The plus three speed on Gilmore makes a huge difference. There's, it's, it's, it's hard for the receivers to have actually separation with Jonathan Joseph. Of course, he's gonna have some some um water receivers that burn him. Like, in real life, no cornerback is perfect. He is not perfect either. If someone motion snaps, he he will get beat on a slant. Um, there's sometimes a, a, a player is going to get a better release on a streak, and he's going to be open. But, in general, he did not get got beat once over the top for me. Not even once, guys. Maybe he did, and the, and the opponent didn't throw that. Because he caught up to the receiver pretty damn well. He is amazing, guys. If I had to, to buy a corner right now, I would definitely buy Jonathan Joseph. I really would take him, guys, before the other top five cornerbacks. He is really good. Like I said, my final thoughts, he has very good man, he has very good zone, and he has decent speed. He's not going to be burned by every single receiver you face. If you put him as wide receiver 1, 2, or 3, he's going to do a very solid job there. Now, of course, he's not perfect. He will beat, get beat in motion slants, like 99% of the cornerbacks. He will get beat, and you have to change that. If you're playing man-to-man -man all, all game, he will get beat by motion slants. Just be in the lookout for that. And he's not the fastest. I mean, 80-80 is pretty good, but he's not Denzel Ward. But for the price, he is amazing, guys. The overall rating I will give him is an 8.9 out of 10. He is my favorite cornerback right now, guys. If you have the coins and you need a cornerback, go get Jonathan Joseph. If you find it informative, if you liked it, if you liked the review, don't forget to leave a like, subscribe, and a comment, guys. But until then, I will see you next time. Ciao, ciao.